I was gonna say based on the how the title looked, I'm like it could be spooky. Horror is my favorite genre, so always welcome. I would imagine, especially with that opening, definitely a horror game. Got some Dead Space style going on where the health is on the character. I'm like, that dude's already dead. I saw the hand. I'm not gonna lie, it looks creepy enough. It's futurist futuristic creepy. With droids and aliens. You got me. Future horror. Oh, hey. This dude, he's probably going to be fine. So I was just about to say, like, hey, kill somebody in the trailer. Okay, he's dead. Okay, they killed somebody in the trailer. He was not important. I'm sure that's not the first time that's ever actually happened, but it just seems like it takes so long sometimes. It's like, you know, make me think, make me care for them and then kill them. Callisto. Okay. So, aside from the whole neck health deal, Dead Space wise, uh, that could definitely be close to Dead Space if done right. It seems like there would be more people, so it probably won't get to that realm. I'm feeling some Dead Space vibes, but, and there's yeah. little why you know him from his work on Dead Space and Call of Duty. Here's the CEO of Striking Distance. Okay. Studios, Glenn Schofield. Hey, Glenn. Okay. Hey, thanks, Jeff. That well, explains the it. The protocol has been in development hmm. for uh, over a year. I'm buying that. A team of well over 100 people on I'm it. I'm buying that. It's a single-player, third-person, story-driven survival horror game set in the year 2320 on Jupiter's moon of Callisto. Our goal is to make the single most scariest game for PC and consoles. I'm and feeling we're so happy. excited to be able to show it here tonight. Awesome, thank you very much. I'm happy much, about man. that. I'm looking forward to hearing more about that. That might be my favorite announcement so far. In July, Warhammer 40K Dark Tide is a four player co op game from Fat Shark. I may never get my Warhammer Dead Space 4. I'm telling you, if I win tonight, for whatever reason, the, the lottery that I never play, and I get like a billion dollars. I'm gonna find a way. I'm gonna make that space for it happen. I will pay the. That's one of my like. That's one of my things. I'm like, if I ever got just Bezos money, which I won't. But if I ever got Bezos money, I'd be like, how can I make that space for a thing? Like, how can I get Ash vs Evil Dead at the very least, a finale comic series or something? Like, I would just pay all this money just for, like, the stories I want to see completed. Because that's how much I love those 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 stories, really. Those franchises. Like, how much would it cost to just finish this story? This looks good, by the way. I'm sure he said something about the title. I'm sure it came up. But, um... This actually does look interesting. There's been a lot of monsters lately. Like, a lot of zombie-esque looking characters. But this seems cool. It's also multiplayer. It's interesting. I had a lot of zombies and go up. Oh, this is the Dark Tide thing. It actually looks cool. I've never played Warhammer, but it actually looks nice. Now